glass products are really difficult to make. You need large machines, lots of experience, lots of money. We're maple glass printing. What we do is we 3D print glass. Straight from a digital design, we can make glass products in one step. A benefit with glass 3D printing is that we can use 100% recycled glass and divert it away from landfill. I started at Maple Glass Printing doing an internship when the glass 3D printing was just an idea. I've seen the prototype be built and the first and second iterations of our commercial machines. Being able to see our vision come to life is really rewarding. Glass 3D printing could come into any industry. Art, architecture and research are the main ones that we focus at right now. But we're really excited to see where it goes in the future. So maple glass printing is trying to solve a big problem for society. We are imagining a world where landfill no longer exists. So being able to conquer that is our infinite goal. However, on the pathway to that goal, there's some really interesting things. So the ability to enable artists to create designs, the ability to create a more sustainable world by turning waste material into structural materials, and the ability to really unlock a future for glass that hasn't even been imagined. When you can make glass in all sorts of shapes, you create new designs, new configurations and new geometries that gives a new lease on life on glass. The glass 3D printing process starts with a design. Whether you design the model yourself or whether you download it online, and then we create your glass filament, which you can create from waste glass. We've got a machine for this process. You can use bottled glass, art glass, crystal glass. Once you've got your filament, you can then load it into the Maple 3D printer, hit print, and your design will be brought to life in glass. Maple Glass Printing is working with me to be their first artist in residence. I'm very honored and excited about this role. What's really exciting about 3D glass printing technology and the implications that it has for art and design, of course, is that it's an opportunity for many different fields to converge. We've got engineers, we've got designers, artists that have to come together for, I think, this type of potential to be realized in the future. The sky is the limit. We don't know where that potential ends and it's a really exciting position to be in. We have growth plans in two directions. So the one growth plan is to scale as a company and to get our technology out there in the wild. So entering markets like North America and giving people the opportunity to see and interact with our technology. A parallel pathway in terms of how we're going to scale the company is to have a completely new lease on a different product and that's a large format printer. So our company values are really about recycling and making a difference. So being able to scale the size of things of which we print through large format printing means that we can recycle more, we can make larger products, and we can enter sectors like the architectural length scale centers, actually being able to use glass to really unlock its capabilities on the large scale. So very exciting times. 